This is video three for week seven for ITSY. I'm starting at slide 13. Um, so I said we need to be able to create learning experiences that help participants achieve the learning outcomes. And on the last slide, I showed you how I'm gonna do that in this unit um, this week and next week for training. And I just want you to take a moment to take a look at slide 14 and 15 and, and uh, do this little activity and, and read my comments underneath. Um, it's just sort of like an example of your learning activities have to actually teach something and you need to be able to verify that the person actually learned something from your activity. Okay, and this is when these two activities talk about reading comprehension. So just because you know all the words, if I teach you all the words, doesn't mean that you can comprehend, right? So you, you know all these words, but do you know what they mean when I write them in a paragraph like this? Okay, so we have to think about just because when we're teaching, really make sure that our activities um, actually teach somebody something and they can confirm that or we can confirm that we comprehend the information. And this is just a follow-up activity. And it says, like, if you don't understand the words, that you're reading, can you still pass a comprehension test? Sure you can. Try to answer the questions. Okay, uh, there's a little learning activity you can do here when you click, just to make sure you understand the um, whole pedagogical uh, approach called backwards design. 